For this problem, we're going to rewrite 3 and 1 fifth as a fraction. This picture shows three holes split up into five parts with one part left over. The numerator in the fraction represents how many parts we have altogether. The first three bars have five parts each, and the last bar has one part. So altogether, we have 16 parts. This means that 16 is going to go in the numerator. The denominator represents how many parts are in each hole. So this will stay the same, and we will have 5 in the denominator. So 16 fifths is our final answer.